for Kagi. As you said, Denzine, the Slovenian, giving every effort, but Jack was just too strong. <laughs> he was too strong. There's a lot of new faces in this competition that we haven't uh, seen before. What's really nice is that they've moved quickly down onto map three to show the Brazilian and the Japanese because we were quick to say that whatever happened, the gold medal in this category was going to go to Pan America, but the Japanese is not out yet. They may have put out the French girl, but Agata from Japan is here. There are two and a half minutes left. Uh, Aguiar of Brazil who put out Audrey Chuemo earlier on. She's up against Agata of Japan and I'll leave uh, you with Loretta and Denzine. Right, it's an Uchimata attack there from the Japanese girl Agata and uh, the one thing that's been noticeable about this competition is how how Uchimata has come back into its oh, own it's again. Fantastic. It's one of my favourite techniques. It wasn't very good at it, but I loved the technique. Oh, I think it's a fantastic technique, but over the last few years, people have become so afraid to try it because the leg grabbing. they were grabbing the legs or doing that stupid counter, which uh, referees were scoring as a throw for the other person, which in my opinion wasn't right. was nothing. But uh, there we are, and they're not doing that anymore. No. So you can attack with Uchimata with freedom. It doesn't matter if you go over onto your back, lose your balance. It doesn't matter. It's not going to be counted against you. And therefore, we've seen a lot of people now trying Uchimata. And I think that's a good thing. Oh, it's a fantastic thing. The only thing we've seen now is the Uchi matter if they're just a little bit too slow or their opponent sees it coming is the sidestep into the Harai or the, the, the Tayatoshi. Yeah. And we've seen that a couple of times yesterday. A fantastic yeah. move. But that's the danger from not demonstrating Uchi matter well. Well, that's how Pietri won the final of the under-81s under yesterday. That's right. Yeah. Brilliant performance from him lifted the roof off of this building the French crowd went wild but uh, we're still here now with this uh, women under 78 and the Brazilian gets a second wind up and that gives the Japanese a lead a Yuko lead two lefties big Ochi from uh, Agata she scores Yuko but uh, in my opinion the referee was a little too generous with that it's been uh, overturned, it's been overturned and uh, quite, right, quite rightly as well. Definitely. And now Ogata's looking for the Sangaku, she's got the leg in, she's crossed the legs, all she has to do is roll back over to the other side. She grabs the trouser leg to get the leverage and she's done it. She's gone back. She's got the Osakami now. That was a well-worked move from uh, Agata. Look at that composure there. There's no way she's getting out. It's all over for Agua of Brazil. Good performance from Agata. Well worked move on the ground. So you get an image of the hall there and uh, how well the French Judo Federation have done to put this event on at such short notice. They only knew about this in September. 
That's right. Eight weeks ago, wasn't uh, it? Eight weeks ago to put this uh, world.